guys, it is me, Life Simmer, and welcome to the latest and final Sims 3 store set. It is crazy to be saying that, but yeah, I can't believe it's like the last one. Um, so today we're going to be overviewing the last venue of Amore, uh, which is like, you know, the last venue of love. Um, so pretty much, um, right now, if you want this set, it is actually on sale. Um, I would recommend watching this video through and then deciding if you want it. As usual, I will be giving my little itty bitty teeny weeny review at the end with my opinion on if I think it is completely worth it. Um, now like I said, this will be the last available content to actually you know, put in your Sims 3 game, which is insane because I've been collecting store content and doing overviews for it for like the longest time. And if you also stay tuned till the end, I will be doing a little giveaway because it is actually the last, uh, you know, store content. So yeah. Um, anyways, so this, uh, set itself comes with 30 items, one pretty, uh, content item, one venue, 12 wallpapers, and the rest of the items are build slash buy mode items. Um, and the premium content is the gondola of the sinking city. Now, for those who don't know, you know, gondolas are very, very, very popular in Venice. And how, you know, I, I learned this when I was really, really young because I actually played a video game where it was based in Venice and it was so much fun and you would have to ride the gondolas and I don't know. Um, actually, I wasn't that young, but, you know, it was, it was still cool. Um, but... Um, so currently it's on sale for 1,700 sim points, but that's going to end on the 10th and it'll go for 1,900 sim points, which is equivalent to about $20 uh, USD. So let's go ahead and jump into this set. I'm actually really, really excited because I think it is so, so, so gorgeous. So Alrighty, so here is the venue. It is 64 by 64. Um, that's the dimensions of it. And, you know, I have it here in Monte Vista. It, it fits perfectly here. It really, really does. But, you know, I placed it right here and the road's like <laughs> totally not leveled up, but ignore that seriously. Like, I don't know why it's doing that. It's really annoying, but welcome to Monte Vista. Um, so my first impression of how freaking gorgeous this is like I can't get over it I think it is so 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 gorgeous um it's like a mini city but one thing I do want to see is actually oh okay so what we're gonna do is explore it I think we'll explore it first and then we will you know take a ride on the gondola all right so let's see if we start off to right here, we have like, it's pretty much going to be like little apartments and everything because that's what, you know, the theme kind of is. It's like, oh, you're, you know, gondoling, gondoling <laughs> down Venice. So yeah, I do really like these arches right here. Um, here's like a little, little house, a little bedroom. Then if we go upstairs in the house just kind of like out here. There's really nothing too uh, crazy inside of these buildings, I can already tell, but you know, you have like a little patio out here, and if we come over here, a couch and stuff. There, like I said, there's nothing that, you know, would wow you guys in here, but it's it's still good to show you guys. Um, so here's like some sitting tables, and... It's really actually nothing. <laughs> Over here, you know, you can play some chest, uh, paint a little bit, play um, the guitar. If we go up a level, some bookshelves. Um, over here, we have, you know, another table, some chairs. It's pretty much the same thing throughout. There's nothing that I actually really need to show you guys. Um, I'm just going to show it to you guys for the sake of the video. Um, more dining, we go down, more dining, computers, another computer, more dining, a TV room, like I said, nothing too magnificent about the inside, which, you know, isn't really the main focus. Um, so yeah, but one thing I did want to show you guys is, um, you know, how beautifully they placed the greenery in this set, like, I'm in love 
with like all of this, but I'm pretty sure there is like a chapel in here. If I'm correct. I could be wrong. Nope, I'm right. <laughs> oh, nope, I'm wrong. Um, but it is pretty much supposed to be a chapel. Uh, you can place right here, you know, a an arch. Is that what it's called? What is it called? What is it called? I forget. You know, you can get married in here. If you place that right here, your sims can come here and get married. So I would, the Chapel of Amor, I would definitely recommend it. Um, but alrighty, so here are my two lovely sims. I mean, she doesn't look too pleased. She actually looks pretty pissed. He's just like, oh. Um, but they are going to go back there and ride the gondolas. But before we do that really, really, really quickly, I wanted to show you guys, um, some of the wallpapers, so they're pretty much like this. They're sets that are supposed to make the buildings look really, really old. And I feel like they really do do uh, justice for that because <laughs> I think they look pretty old and gorgeous. And like I'm in Venice, so I'm a fan. I'm a fan of the wallpapers because I feel like I'm in Venice. Um, so let's go ahead and ride with Laren. And uh, here's the gondola itself. It looks like a gondola. <laughs> so my sims are going to come over here and uh, jump in the gondola. Oh, look. There's actually somebody. Okay. Some random woman. There's a gondola down there. Okay, so here they come. So beautiful here, huh? I love it. I want to go to Italy. <laughs> Alrighty, so here they come. Okay. Sunla. Pajo. Garava. <laughs> Wow, okay. Look at, they're all like, oh my gosh, look at that. <laughs> so there they go, under the bridge. I really love the water. Is that weird that I like, like the water? <laughs> so here they are taking a corner. I think it's adorable, personally. I wonder if they can do any interaction. Alrighty, everybody. So here you're about to see my sims actually cuddle. There are two interactions that you can do. You can cuddle and make out. Uh, so here they are, you know, cuddling. And here they are making out. <laughs> so it's pretty much like if your sims were, you know, on a couch. But oh, that was so cute. Oh my goodness. And right now we are actually in like a little tunnel. I like how she's like checking her watch. Like, are they done? Alrighty, let's go. You guys are done making out now. So we're going to keep going. I love it. I think it is so, so cute. So we're going to continue with the gondola. We're literally in the gondola, guys. So... So gorgeous. Look at Monte Vista in the background. I love it. So, so romantic and beautiful. Like, what a perfect date. Look, they're like pointing. Oh, look, there's Monte Vista. <laughs> I like that it's really, you know, slow and romantic and it's not rushed and it's a big venue. And now I understand why, because your sims literally go around the whole entire venue, just, you know, gondoling through it and relaxing. And I love that. I do. You know, I hate when, you know, for example, the roller coaster, which is really, really rushed. Um, I mean, it's a roller coaster, so I understand. But something like this, like, it's perfect. Like a nice evening, you know, where your sims can just go go gondoling. <laughs> Is that what it's called? I don't know, but I think it's lovely. So here they go turning another corner. As you can see, this is really like a long process, a long ride. <laughs> um, but I think they're going to be pulling in rather shortly to finish their gondola ride, actually. Yep, this is like the final 
Oh, well, they're like screaming. This is like the final Inu roundabout right here. And then it's pretty much over. I wish that like the person who was working the gondola had like a little elf on like they do in Venice. <laughs> I'm actually supposed to be going to Venice, um, I think this summer, actually. So we will see if that actually happens. But here we go, uh, pulling in. And I want to see if we get any new moodlets or anything. But as for the premium content item, I am a fan. I think it's really, really cute. And oh, what? She needs to stop with all of that. Our gondola lady thinks my boy's cute. Um, so that right there is the gondola. And there is a moodlet. It says right here, wonderful ride. What a wonderful ride, which is awesome. And my, oh, she actually got, um, where is she? Did she get a tan? Did she get a tan from riding around? She's pleasantly warm. Alrighty, everybody. So that is the gondola premium content item, um, which pretty much is, you know, the set. It's amazing. I love the gondola um, because, A, I'm, like, historically, like, I love things like this. And, you know, I live in America. I don't know where I can go gondolin. If you know, let me know. I would love to go. But, you know, stuff like this that is historically rich and reminds me of amazing places in the world. It just, it warms me. I freaking love it. I love holidays. I love fall time. And I love history, as a lot of you guys know. Um, so... Uh, this makes me really, really happy. Um, now, because there isn't really too much to explore, I do want to just let you guys know one more thing. See this window right here? This big glass window. That's actually a new item, which I think would be fantastic for builders, um, you know, who like to make churches and stuff like that. I would highly recommend, you know, that because I think it would look amazing. But as for the set and everything, <clears throat> This video is probably not the longest because, you know, inside of the buildings, there's literally nothing to show off other than the church right there. As for that, the premium content item is literally about it. Um, so do I think it is worth 1,700 sim points? Um, this is how I'm going to put it. If you're like me and you are constantly looking for new things for your sims to do you know besides sitting at home it's what i like to do i would highly recommend this set um maybe not everything maybe if the premium content item is you know available for individual sale i would probably pick that up and maybe try building my own you know venue however i think it is so beautiful so so beautiful and i think it is so cute so no i necessarily don't think it's worth you know 17 to 19 dollars um that is pretty much you know a a stuff pack and i don't know i'm just somebody who i'm not frugal at all but i do like a bang for my buck and i just feel like this one really wasn't. Um, however, I still, you know, I like it, just not enough to pay, you know, pretty much $20 for it. Um, but I like to get them and overview them so you guys know whether you want it or not. Um, 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 I keep saying um, but for 30 items, I just, I don't think it's worth it. I'm sorry. Um, 12 of the items are wallpapers and I just, I don't. Um, as for the last venue, I, I do think it's gorgeous and I will, you know, always remember my little gondola ride in here and my little mini Venice. Um, but yeah, I just, you know, I wish there was more. I wish there was more premium content item, like one more premium content item in here that, you know, was more in depth than just a gondola ride. I feel like it would have made this set a lot better. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say about this set and, um... I hope you guys enjoy it, and oh, for the giveaway, hello! <laughs> um, pretty much all you have to do is comment down below your Sims 3 username, um, and I will be drawing those winners probably Saturday, so you have a couple of days to do so. 
So I hope this helped you decide whether you wanted this or not. Um, and if you do really want it, I would highly recommend picking it up this weekend. It will save you two bucks. Um, so yeah, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye, everybody.